with the Equinox 900. New field, new area. Let's see what we're going to fight today. That's a big coin, not sure what that is. How is it a pendant? Wow, that's something interesting. Look at that. Commemorative. Not sure. It's a commemorative pendant. Interesting. Very good. Uh -huh. I think we've got some sort of... I think this is a Victorian dress weight. That's what I think this is. Victorian dress weight and you can tell by the holes in it uh, a bit of a pottery of some kind eh? one side glazed, not over that so it could be 1920 century maybe a little bit earlier oh very posh uh, KJ lipstick might come in use for later Rimmel. Oh yes. Uh, yeah. Oh, that's perfect. Is that? I'll put a bit of that on. Look, look, look good. <laughs> KG lipstick. Eh? Nice colour. And that was at uh, sixty-two. <laughs> oh, jolly good. 81 <laughs> The plate Brass bucket And we've got a sort of a A key plate And then the other side is the cover to the door <laughs> Must have come off Looks like Victorian, so it's a bit like that should slide off really. Yeah. Should. So that's it, yeah. So it slides off, put your key in, no draft. Like a draft cover for a door. Different. 34. 73. Uh -huh. It's a door handle. Another Victorian door handle. Look at that size of that. Got the key old. Key plate. And I got the door handle now. 73. So we've got the a trading weight. I think it looks like about one ounce that. Huh? Not really sure. See so, designs on that. So it's a brass weight, trading weight. That's interesting uh, decoration. 62. Oh that's nice. Yeah. Metal lead though. Sort of decoration, big stud of some kind. Not sure what they used it for, but it's it's big. The artifacts and stuff that's come out of here is just unbelievable, really. All these coins that have come out of here. Look at that, George III, massive penny. Look at all these coins. Look at them all. Pretty fact, twenty-six coins. Uh, I've been doing this field quite a lot this morning and a lot of coins. heading back to the car and I just thought it's got to be silver there's got to be silver on this field and I was right but this is no ordinary 
silver. No, ordinary silver. This is an awesome hammered. A big one. I mean, a big one. <laughs> I can't get over it. I'm not really sure I think it's Charles the First. Um, 12, is it 12 pennies? I don't really know. It's XX11. Is, it, is, is that? Oh, I don't know what that is. I, I've got to check it out. I'm just a bit excited. What happened? Check this out. Awesome. Oh, what, guys? This is just unbelievable. Oh, there it is. There it is, guys. Look at that, guys. Look at the size of that hammer. Just ponder for a the minute there. Just ponder. Holy Toledo's. Oh, my giddy ant. The size of that hammer is unbelievable. Oh, man. Let's pick it up now, then, guys. Let's pick it up. Let's look at it at close quarters now. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 look at that, guys. Look at that. I don't believe the size of that. That is big, guys. Massive. Hammered. Oh, to die for. This is what detecting's all about. Getting big hammered. Oh, I don't believe it. <laughs> I'm in shock. I really am in shock. That is just awesome. Going to go back to the car for some tweets and a bit of lunch, just five minutes break. But I'm going back on. Petrol cap. Um, Top 1950s Pratt, I think 1920s, 30s, a bit of pottery. It's a blue glaze lines. Don't think it's Victorian, it's a bit too ordinary for Victorian. I think it's well after. Just two with me, yeah. So, so we up the day as do, yeah. Sure That's brilliant. Okay, see what I found then. Okay, then, Ken, show us what you found then. Uh, yeah, local. Yeah, that's a D buckle. There's another one, buckle. Another type of buckle, yeah. Is it a bridle, is it horse bridle belt? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, you've got some sort of heart there as well. Like, a heart yeah? there. Oh, all oh, right, okay. I've uh, got a musket ball. Musket shot, oh, that's 16, yeah, 16 to uh, 18th century. Is it with a veil? Is it with the veil? Oh, I thought it was a bun. No, it's with a veil. Oh, with the veil, all oh, right, okay. Yeah, that's yeah. eight. Is that, uh, I forgot, is it 1896 or something? I don't know. Yeah, oh. yeah. I've got two Georgia 5th pennies. I've got two Georgia 5th pennies, yeah, okay. And two, there's a button there. Yeah, uh, button. Is that Georgia 3rd? Georgia 3rd. Yeah. 3rd half penny. And then another Georgia 3rd half penny. That's uh, truly it's, one. Yeah, yeah, one. it's a bit and a half, but it looks like something yeah, interesting. Another button. Another button. And then, uh, what else did you finish up weekend? We've got a silver... Hey! Got a bit of silver, Ken! Hey! What? Willem the third, Ken! Yeah, and I think it's one of those uh, three pences. Three pences, yeah. Silver, that! Silver. Hey, very good, man! You're on silver, pal! We found a lot of stuff today. Yeah. And of course, the exciting one is I'm going to leave to the end. <laughs> First thing I want to, to note is... um. I got some lipstick, so I'm all right for you know keeping me uh, lips nice and um, moist. Uh, red. Come on, where is it going? Oh, is it turning? Oh. <laughs> nice and red, see. <laughs> see? Uh, you know, so perfect. That's perfect. Is that? Uh, we'll skip that, John. Yeah, K KJ. Very nice. <laughs> okay, right. Let's get down to. So we'll start with uh, trading weight, one ounce, probably 20, 19th to 20th century. Uh, clock clasp, uh, petrol cap, Pratt, the 1950s. 
Uh, door handle. Probably Victorian, maybe. Can't handle it. Buckle. Can you buckle. Another buckle. So belt buckles. I've thrown in a bit of uh, pottery there. 17th century pottery. Just there. Uh, I think that's 19, 1930s pottery. With a bit of design. And then um, we've got... A, uh, I think it's a key plate and cover, Victorian, I think. Don't ask me how that got into the middle of the field, I just don't know. <laughs> Do you, oh, I don't know. A bit sick. And we've got all the coins. Elizabeth II. Elizabeth II. Three penny bit, three pence, probably 1960s. George III, George III, George III, Penny, more or less. Another George III, Penny there, look. Uh, Victoria. Here we have it. The best find of the day. Best find of the day. <laughs> John is absolutely... Hammered. Shilling. Of Charles I. Don't know the date, because I've got to check that out on my, on my little book. Big, in it? He's absolutely... He's big, in it? Eh, big man. Oh, he's got a bit of a goatee beard as Charles, Charles I. And yeah. Charles I is the guy that got his head chopped off. And he wasn't well after that. <laughs> so. He lost his head. That is down the guys. A big one. Look at the trash. Oh, the blooming. That's the trash, guys. That's all the foil. Foil, tin cans, bottle tops. You name it, we got it. Except for the banana skin. <laughs> Your banana skin's in on the crisp packet. <laughs> I didn't find a banana skin. <laughs> All right. So we dug the trash out and we removed the trash. We were very good people. Very good. Very good. Yeah. Tidy, tidy, tidy trash collectors. But yeah, awesome day. Absolutely buzzing. Pity every day can't be the same. And uh, thank you very much for watching. And catch you on another adventure. Hey. Yeah, we'll see you later. And uh, that's that's an enjoyable day. I'm glad John's got that coin. It's made his day having. And uh, Ken's ready for an amber as well. <laughs> yeah, I'm ready for an amber as well, yeah. <laughs> yeah I'm not for a long time. Don't worry, Ken. Your time will come, pal. Right. See you later. We'll close now. We'll see you later.